Nathaniel Howe. You're the champion of Kirkwall, aren't you? And... Anders! Making friends as always, I see. There's no escaping you, it seems. I'm special that way. That's one way to put it. I don't remember drawing anyone a map to the Tide. Who told you about it? An unfortunate dwarf named Bartrand. We weren't sure his information was reliable, but contacting you or Varric was deemed risky. You trusted my turncoat of a brother, but thought talking to us was risky. That's idiotic. We feared you might return if you learned of our interest in the Taig. Delilah says you followed my expedition's route. Why? You went further into the Deep Roads than anyone believed possible. The First Warden himself ordered this investigation. I was offered a generous share of the salvage, plus extra coin up front to discourage any... curiosity. It looks like you met heavy resistance. After the Warden Commander spared the Architect, we thought the ensuing struggle among the Darkspawn might make the Deep Road safer. The Warden's allies assured us these tunnels would still be mostly clear, but it seems they were wrong. They seem to know a great deal about Darkspawn. Are these allies dwarves? No, not dwarves. It's complicated. Let's just say we live in strange times. Who is the Architect? The Architect was the first of the speaking and thinking Darkspawn. Very dangerous. He spread his gift to other Darkspawn. The Disciples. Fortunately, their numbers are few. We should bring your sister the good news. I cannot leave now. When we were attacked, I was separated from the rest of my expedition. Some of them may yet live. We must go deeper into the tunnels to rescue them. Who else could be alive? Some wardens survived the initial ambush. I think the dwarf we brought from Vigil's Keep survived. But who still lives? Only the Maker knows. We have survivors to find. Let's go. We should move. Stay alert for Darkspawn. <laughs>